Hello, I'm Sharon Bradley, Senior Infection Prevention Analyst for the Pennsylvania Patient Safety Authority. Norovirus is a highly contagious gastrointestinal virus that spreads rapidly in healthcare facilities due to a low infectious dose, a short incubation period, and environmental persistence. Transmission can occur by hand-to-mouth contact after exposure to contaminated skin, body fluids, or environmental surfaces, by exposure to aerosolized vomitus, and by ingestion of food contaminated by ill healthcare workers. Consistent with the Center for Disease Control recommendations, there are three key approaches to integrate norovirus control strategies into clinical practice. Healthcare facilities are better equipped to respond to norovirus when protocols for preventive measures are in place before norovirus season arrives. Pre-season administrative measures include assuring sufficient resources, preparation of education materials, monitoring hand hygiene practices, and clearly designating tasks and communication responsibilities. If norovirus cases do occur, the rapid simultaneous implementation of multiple control measures is key to reducing the magnitude of outbreaks. Keep a daily unit record of symptomatic patients for early case detection and notification to the infection control staff. Cohort ill patients and contact precautions with separate access to toileting facilities until 48 hours after resolution of vomiting and diarrhea. Require strict hand washing with soap and water for a full minute after contact with diarrheal patients their environment, and before food handling. Exclude ill staff members from work until symptom-free for 48 hours. Uncontrolled outbreaks of norovirus may prompt more stringent measures. Increase environmental cleaning to two times a day for patient care areas and three times a day for frequently touched surfaces with a bleach solution or disinfectant approved for norovirus. Use gowns, gloves, and masks to clean up vomitus and feces, and avoid agitating soiled linen. Consider suspending group activities, assigning ill residents to recovered staff, and closing wards to admissions, transfers, and visitors. Pennsylvania Patient Safety Authority's Norovirus Prevention Toolkit, as well as detailed practical strategies, can be found at the link below this video.